I wanted to take a moment here to share a little bit about cooking from an emotional perspective, speaking from the inner life of a family chef. I myself did not learn to cook when I was a child or even a teen. Cooking came much later in life for me. I am very much a family cook. I am not a professional chef at all. <laughs> And although I seek out information in the how-to field from books and videos for exciting new recipes, I hardly come across any dialogue on the internal process of being a family chef. So I wanted to share my inner journey of preparing food. I have always thought I wanted to cook for others and have considered owning my own bed and breakfast with my husband. He is a master of creating flavor. But alas, thus far, I have only cooked for my own family, and truth be told, that is plenty. At first when I learned to cook, it was difficult. I followed each recipe with care, only to end up with trial and error meals that sadly were not as delicious as the recipe creator had promised. In time, I learned to trust my own instincts and palate to tweak recipes that ended rather well. My favorite flavors are from homegrown foods, prepared and tasted at the moment of ripening. The connection between the desire to be both farmer and chef go hand in hand. The flavors plus health benefits of eating seasonal foods are partially responsible for my motivation to seek a homesteading life. I aspire to live a life that includes seasonal eating and it's only been a season since I started growing my own food, but it has truly been satisfying. I bake for my family, but do not often partake as I live a grain and dairy-free lifestyle due to my preference to be happy both in mind and body. But the art of baking intrigues me. It is a science similar to herbalism, or composting, or growing a garden, and recipe creation always calls to me. There is a joy like no other when I give sustenance to someone I love. And to make something from scratch is a skill I am honored to practice for the rest of my days. I am a family chef practicing daily. I am a mere family baker. And for peace in mind, I will humbly bake. My inner life as a chef is one that is constantly evolving. As a beginner, felt anxious and clumsy. Moving away into a more experienced family chef, I now feel confidence and trust, for I trust my intuition. I trust in myself to know that I will know exactly what to do and when to do it, and the recipe, she is merely a guide now. I can sense when food is done baking by the sounds and smells. I can sense when a proof is complete, even if the timer says otherwise. A little jolt of energy flows through me, similarly to the feeling when a stirring child is about to wake. Baking and cooking bring to me a sense of accomplishment. Underneath, I am in deep creation. When I bake, I feel the same inwardly as when I'm crafting. I feel like a chemist when I time things just perfectly, and my heart is full of joy when a bake is complete. My inner life as a family chef is one that is constantly evolving. As a beginner, I felt anxious and clumsy. Moving away into a more experienced family chef, I feel confident and intuitive. I trust in myself to know I know exactly what to do and the recipe is merely a guide now. Is that a metaphor for life, you might ask? Perhaps. Perhaps it is. <laughs>